Hi guys, what is up? Welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be going over my top five products from Shantikai. So if you want to see what those are, then just keep watching. Hi guys, if you're new here, my name is Morgan. I am a product knowledge enthusiast. I just love knowing anything and everything about all of the new makeup on the market and sharing my thoughts with you guys. Tis the season of sales. Black Friday's coming around the corner, so Gigi's Beauty thought it would be a good idea for us to come up with our top five products for the Shantikai sale. So today's video, I am collaborating with my friend Gigi's Beauty. She is a luxury skincare and makeup channel. I've been loving her channel recently to watch all of her luxury makeup videos. She covers a lot. She gets a lot of the new products out very, very quickly and she knows her stuff. She really does and she's very passionate about the luxury side of makeup. I believe she's based in Toronto and really cool. She is a cosmetic nurse injector, which I think is really awesome. So I think Gigi might be a little bit more well-versed in Shantikai than I am. So definitely make sure you guys go check out her video. I will put the link to her channel, her Instagram and her video down below. I'm really interested interested in seeing the products that she would pick out. I wonder how ours compare. I can't wait to watch hers. Anyways, make sure you go subscribe to her. Let's get into the video. Okay, I mean, if you watch my channel regularly, I feel like you might know what the majority of the products I'm going to pick are. Oh, let me go over the details of the sale. Duh. So the sale is supposed to start today. November 19th, if I have that correct. And you can get the details to the sale to shop if you sign up to Shantikai's newsletter. So make sure you guys do that. The sale, I believe, is 30% off their site. And 30% off is significant. This ain't no 10, 15, 20% on the VIB sale. Shantikai is quite a pricey brand. So that 30% off, I think is gonna make a big difference. So now is really the time to shop from Shantikai if you've been wanting to. I find their makeup line to be relatively small. So it's pretty easy for me to pick my top Products. I have some staples in here. So since Shantikai is so pricey, I really wanted to curate a list where I genuinely thought that these products would be worth the money. I have a kinship to Shantikai. Shantikai was one of the first brands of makeup that I actually used, which sounds a little bit crazy, but blame my mother. Anyways, you guys know she's one of us luxury lovers. I stood no chance. So let's start off with the foundation that I absolutely love from Shantikai. This is the Future Skin Oil Free gel foundation. Funny enough, this was my first ever foundation and I stopped using it years and years ago after I had finished my tub. I actually purchased this at another Shantikai sale a couple of months ago and I love this as an everyday foundation. I wear the shade vanilla. It is so lightweight on the skin. You don't feel anything and it provides you a light medium coverage. It definitely isn't going to get past that medium coverage point, but it just feels so lightweight on the skin. It gives a nice even coverage all over the skin as well so it just evens out all of your imperfections but it makes your skin look really fresh it feels really fresh because it's a gel foundation and I think with zoom meetings working online it's a great foundation to throw on just to feel a little bit better even if you're not leaving the house it freshens up your face so when you look in the mirror you know you feel more confident it's quick to throw on and it's gonna look good through the video camera as well. So I really like this as an everyday foundation. I definitely think if you were interested in taking advantage of the sale that this is one product that would be amazing. The next product, now this one is quite a hyped up product and for very good reason. So this is the Perfect Blur Finishing Powder. First of all, the packaging is absolutely stunning. And I use this as a finishing veil. I do my base as I normally would, set my face with powder, blush, bronzer, highlight, but I do like to go over with a brush. My favorite brush to use is the refer number 19 for this step. And I'll just go ham in here and I get right in this area. This area is where I'm the most porous and I feel like it definitely blurs over your pores. I get right into the center of my forehead as well. And I have never come across a more blurring powder. I definitely drink the Kool-Aid with this because I didn't understand why people were talking so extremely highly of this product. How much of a difference could it really make? It really does blur more than any powder I have ever experienced. Of course, let's be realistic, it's not gonna make your pores disappear, but pretty darn close, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about the eyeshadow that I have on the eyes. Guys, you need you need to check out these luminescent eye shades. If you're gonna invest in one thing from this sale, you have to 
pick these up. These are my favorite product in this entire video. They are so stunning. You guys know how I feel about eyeshadows. They are so pricey, but full price, they're worth every penny. So imagine them at 30% off. I do believe they came out with some new shades, but let me talk about the shades that I have today. So the one that I have on my eye is the Elephant shade, which is a taupe gray. So I have a very light bronzer in my crease, and then I just have this all over my lid. And seriously, guys, these single shadows have the most glittery, gorgeous shade without being too in your face. It's still quite a sophisticated finish, but the finish is just beautiful. One of the most beautiful ones, though, this is the most unique in terms of something that you won't have in your collection and this is pangolin this is like a dusty lilac shade again very stunning very very unique and then the color that I have on my inner corner and I actually used it on my cheek today as a highlight as well so this one is a bit more versatile you can use this all over the lid as your inner corner or wherever you highlight your face this is the cheetah and the cheetah is just kind of a warm champagne shade I'm not describing it it literally has the shade description on the back so it's a warm champagne and it's so stunning and it has that very slight glitter that the elephant has as well but when you use a fluffy brush for a highlight that glitter just kind of wipes away so 10 out of 10 recommend all of these but I think as far as maybe something more unique that you might not have I would go with pangolin the next product that you absolutely have to have to have to try are their blushes now I don't love the packaging on these I would like to see them a bit cuter a bit more luxurious but the product themselves what is inside is so stunning now when you first buy them They're 20 times more pretty because there's um, a gold overspray over the animal Which I do wish would run throughout the entire pan, but the formula of this is so lightweight It blends onto the skin so effortlessly and it looks very seamless into the skin and it just gives a very natural glow as well It's not highlighty by any means, but it gives a really fresh youthful look to the skin that just makes you look like you're glowing So the two shades that I have the first one is is bliss this is the butterfly one this is the one that I'm wearing today and don't be intimidated by how pale it looks in the pan it really does show up I do think though medium deeper skin tones this probably isn't the shade for you but if you're very fair you will love this but if you're more of a light medium skin tone like me it still is a beautiful fresh color but if you're looking for something that's gonna give you a little bit more oomph I have the shade emotion as well which is the B again this is more of a like gorgeous bright coral color and I I just can't get over how seamlessly these are blend onto the cheek little to no effort no blending is needed at all these seriously are a luxurious formula that I really feel like you can't duplicate at a more affordable price so I love these blushes you don't get a ton of product they're really small and I don't love the packaging but what is inside is really incredible okay the last item that I have are the lipsticks just the plain regular lipsticks they come in very simple silver packaging I have two colors that I absolutely love these are the only two colors that I own but I absolutely love them so the first one is the one that I'm wearing right now now these are an Italian formula they're absolutely stunning this is tulip and it's a bit brighter it's described as like a persimmon kind of color and it's beautiful in the summertime I know we're not in the summer but I want to wear year-round so if I'm looking Looking for a bright lip honestly this is one of my go-to bright lips the formula that Chantecaille has I'm not gonna say it's different than all of the other Italian lipsticks that are out now it's not but it's nice and I like how they have a very curated lip color collection it almost makes it easier to pick out colors because there are less shades it makes it easier for me to have a favorite so if you're looking for a bright lip I think this color is very very unique I do not have a color like this and it really brightens up your face and I think on a deep complexion and this will look killer and then the other shade for all my nude girls I really do love Mirage it's kind of like a dusty lilac pink shade really stunning with just a simple lip liner just for an everyday nude lip color so I have a bright color that I love and I have a nude color that I love so that was a pretty quick video those are my top five favorite products from Chantecaille I've heard some amazing things about their skincare I refuse to jump on that bandwagon because that's a very very expensive bandwagon take a look into the Chantecaille skincare as well they're 
very, very well known for that. But these are my top five products that I really do love and I do feel like it's worth taking advantage of the sale for. My top two are the eyeshadows and probably this blurring powder. I haven't come across another blurring powder like this. So that is all I have for today's video. Make sure you guys go subscribe to Gigi. Tell her that I sent you there and you will really like her content. I wouldn't recommend her to you if I didn't think you wouldn't like it. If you aren't subscribed to my channel, I hope you would consider taking the time to do so. I would really appreciate it and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys, have a good one.